Hello guys, uh, my name is Evans and uh, welcome to this uh, video tutorial. In this tutorial, I'm going to continue looking at the October-November 2017 ITCC ICT Paper 2. Um, in the last video, we ended with step number 14 and in this video, we start with step number 15. So let's go straight to step number 15. Import the image n 17 jpg and place this below the subheading show ex um, excursion. Okay, so um where you here okay so it's here so put your case at the start of the paragraph don't create any space okay don't hit enter key to create any space just at the start of the paragraph then you're going to go to insert and browse to the location where your files are mine they are in this folder here and this is the file in question just paste it there okay so don't change anything until you are told to. Resize, uh, crop the image to remove only the dolphins from the top. Okay, so let's go ahead and remove the dolphins. So go on crop and crop out the dolphins until you have a white background. Okay, next. Um, <clears throat> Resize the image so that it is 3.5 centimeters wide and the image is not distorted. This means maintain your aspect ratio. So for the image resizing, go to size and position and make sure that the width um, the width is 3.5 centimeters. Okay, so here make it 3.5 and make sure aspect ratio at the bottom here is locked. Okay, and do that. Okay, next align the image to the um, top of the margin starting this um, tropical paradise um, and it should be also aligned to the right of the um, column. You should make sure that the text wraps around the image and the image fits within the column um, and it may look something like this. Okay, so what you need to do for you to have text wrapped around there, you need to make sure that you change the layout for this. So make sure that this is something like square and then drag it to the right until you have the green boundaries both on top and left. Okay, so that means it is aligned properly. Uh, with the margin, column margin, as well as with the um, uh, top of the paragraph. So that should be fine. Next, indent the paragraph starting. Keep an eye out by one centimeter from both the left and the right hand margins. And save the document with the file name and format and, uh, and format used in step one. So we're going to do just that. So um, the text, keep an eye out. Okay, so just go here. Um, Hit find on your keyboard, um, I mean, control F on your keyboard to find. And um, so the text we're supposed to say, keep an eye. Okay, so that's the text. And this text, we're supposed to indent it. So select this paragraph and you're going to go on layout and indent one centimeters from um, the left and indent one centimeters also from um, the right margin. And that should be perfectly fine. Okay. All right. So this marks the end of um, document production section. Of course, there will be another section uh, where we come back to this document we just created, and um, we will see how um, we can um, add some um, extra information to this document. So thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video when we start to look at task three databases. All right, so see you.